I am Father B.G. Thomas S.V.D., a divine word missionary. In the Gospel today, the Lord presents the parable of ten virgins, with the five of them being wise in keeping the lamps ready with sufficient oil, and the five being foolish in failing to make any effort to have the lamp lit. The message of the parable is to be ready, dressed for service, and keep your lamps lit. To keep our lamps lit is the reminder and the challenge of the gospel today. At our baptism, we have received the light of Christ. This light is not just to be preserved, but is to be nurtured and fostered daily. But we live in a world where there are many events seeking to put off the light in us. We live in a world where there is a strong engulfing of darkness trying to drown the light in us. What are the different winds that are seeking to put off the light of Christ in us? One of them may be the wind of losing the focus from God. We have many examples in the Bible itself. King David was a shining light to the people of his kingdom as long as he followed the teachings and had his focus on God. But when he allowed his focus to shift from God, he sinned. He allowed himself to focus on the objects of his pleasure by sinning with the wife of Uriah. The wind of losing the focus from God blew strong to put off the light in him. Peter, Peter was a shining light to his disciples as a person of faith. As long as he followed the instructions of his master to walk on the waters. But when he allowed his focus to shift from the Lord, he began to sink. He allowed himself to focus on the object of his fear and self-panic. The wind of losing the focus from God blew strong to put off the light in him. Let us ask ourselves today, am I allowing the wind to lose the focus from God in my life? As the saying goes, we cannot prevent a bird from flying our heads, but we can certainly prevent them from making a nest on our heads. We cannot prevent these winds to hit our lives, but we can certainly prevent them from blowing off the light of Christ in us. This stunt comes from our determination, perseverance, commitment and faith. Lord, give us the strong faith that we keep the lamp of our faith burning till the end of our lives. Amen.